Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to be doing a video on all of the new milestones and achievements for Doom Eternal the Ancient Gods. This video was requested by one of my subscribers, and I decided to do it, so thank you for the suggestion. And you who are watching this can suggest a video right now in the uh, description, or I mean the comments, whatever. Um, I'm more than happy to do any video you suggest, as long as it's Doom related or something that's uh, appropriate. And... Uh, yeah, I'll consider doing any ideas you have, but today I'm going to be doing a 100% achievement guide for Doom Eternal, or at least how to get it, there won't be any gameplay, and I would like to say these screenshots are completely mine. All of these screenshots are mine. Um, yeah, so the first one is Offshore Killing, complete the UAC Atlantic facility. Um, this one, just complete the first mission on any difficulty, you get UAC Atlantic, um, Station Seraphim's Key, which are just the icon and banner. The second thing is Toriental Pain, I think. I don't know. Um, complete the UAC Atlantico facility on Nightmare. Um, you get the UAC rig special background. The third one is to take a life sphere, destroy the life sphere in the blood swamps. So this is just beating the blood swamps on any difficulty. You get the blood swamps. Uh, Ingmore Sanctum and Santa. These are again icons and banners. The next achievement, or the fourth one, is destroy the life or life shattering, destroy the life sphere in the blood swamps on Nightmare. You get the blood swamps uh, menu background. The next one is regime change, uh, defeat Samur and the Holt. You get Amora, the Holt, and Maker's Pride. Again, just banners and icons. Um, again, this is just any difficulty. A uh, hostile takeover, defeat Samur and the Holt on Nightmare. Um, you get the Holt background for the menu and the Bloodmaker icon. Um, again, obviously these are just simple, straight to the point to complete them on any difficulty and then complete them on Nightmare. No explaining needed. Um, and this one, uh, one upsmanship, complete extra life mode with five extra lives in your inventory. You get Argenta Pedestal. Dragon Scale for the um, uh, Ballista and Arc Carrier, which is another banner. Um, this is not hard if you put it on like an easier difficulty and just run through it really quick. It shouldn't take more than an hour or two, and it's an easy achievement milestone get. The next one is Embrace the Madness, Complete the Ancient Gods Part 1 on Ultra Nightmare. You get the Gold Maker Skin and Sanctum. Uh, which is a podium. I am currently working on this one and will most likely make a video on the skin when I get it. Um, so I'll make sure to keep you guys updated. Um, that, like I said, that's difficult and a lot of people probably won't do it and I don't even know if I'll be able to complete it. But if I do, I'll make a video. Um, didn't cross the beams, kill nine spirits in a single safe slot. You get Seance Silencer, a banner. I mean, Spectre, which is a really nice skin for the Plasma Rifle. Um, this one is easy, as long as you just kill all of the um, specters in every secret encounter and throughout the levels, you should get this one easy. The next one is Lucky Charm, acquire a support rune in a single save slot, which you get an icon for. Um, these support runes, you get them from completing either one of the two Slayer Gates or from finding one on the Blood Swamps near the beginning. Lucky Charm Bracelet, acquire all support runes in a single safe slot. You get Arms of a Teeth, which is another banner. And like I said, there is a Slayer Gate on UAC, the oil rig thing. And there's one on the last level, the Holt. And then there's one on Blood Swamps. Supersonic, complete a secret encounter in a single safe slot. You get It's Still Juicy, and it's a, of course, a icon. Um, the secret encounters, uh, you should just look on the map. Honestly, uh, that's my best advice is just look on the map. Um, they should be there uh, on the map for you. Um, complete both secret encounters and the UAC Atlantica facility. Like I said, just look on the map and you'll get industrial espionage, um, a skin for the Slayer, which is an alright recolor. Um, Ghillie suit, complete both secret encounters and blood swamps. Um, same as the last one. Uh, but different map. Wetland Warrior is a really nice recolor in my opinion. That's like top notch. Slayer in red. 
complete both uh, Seer Encounters and the Hulk. Blood Slayer. Blood Slayer is a, also another really nice uh, Slayer retelling. The next one is Hypersonic. Complete all secret encounters in a single save slot. Um, if you do the previous ones, then you're obviously going to get this. And you get Ground Zero, which is another banning. And last, but certainly not least, is Required Reading. Collect all physical codex pages in a single save slot. And you get Sigil for the BFG. I don't personally like this skin, and I don't have it equipped. But you yourself can. And uh, the codex pages are on the map, and they appear as question marks. So that is my advice to you, is just go around looking for the question mark. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching, actually. Um, and that's the end of this, but if you would please consider liking and subscribing if you enjoyed the video, and I hope you did. Like I said, please feel free to leave any criticism or recommendations in the comments below. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for helping grow the channel. We're, we're we are almost at 70 subs, and uh, I really appreciate the support, so thank you for that, and uh, yeah, see ya.